Well, it really was quite by accident. When the nativity was requested of me by Better Homes and Gardens, I didn't work in wood, but I had been an uh, intaglio printmaker. And that involves engraving and etching on metal plates. And so I thought, I'm a painter. I can just paint on wood. I'm also a drawer and an engraver. So that's where the wood burner came from. But as far as the content, I love storytelling. And so from the very get-go, that just felt really good. And so that was the first type of sticks content that I made, which was just coming from me and my life and my experience. The great thing about Styx is it has this foundation of Sarah's vision. I like to think of it as anonymously making someone's day better because people see the work and they're like, oh, that's me, those are my colors, or that's my language, those are my words, or that whole piece, it's personalized in a universal way. Some things have definitely evolved over the ages. It used to be a lot of a looser style of like folk art where we didn't follow the burn line and just like do a lot of rubbing and it was a little bit rougher. It's definitely gotten tighter over the years and it's more of a cleaner look on most things. It just comes very naturally to us now, but not anybody could walk in and do it on the first day. We've just kind of developed it all over the years together, I think. We help people tell the story of their lives on pieces which is always a really fun and fulfilling thing to do. We also kind of try to keep our finger on the pulse of what's going on. So our job is to kind of bring the freshness of what's happening now into our core product. So that's always a, a fun challenge for us to, to make our, our stuff that's been around for 30 years uh, look fresh and new every day. It's amazing how many different artists work here with a different vision of the colors, design, and how it all comes together and becomes sticks. It's amazing.